Hey everyone, Shaber1000 here. Today we're going to be another doing another one of these reviews from the Boldak. Boldak. This one is the cheese. Artificially artificial spicy chicken flavor ramen. Stir fried ramen. So let me get you down here and uh, oh here, I'll show you the nutrition facts right here. And I know guys, on the last one I did, I forgot this part and I'm sorry. So hopefully you can pause that and read it. Uh, so, let me point you down here. I forgot to do an intro. I'm sorry. So it's just just like the other ones, but again for the first timers uh, that may be seeing this for the first time and want to try it, put noodles in to the 20 ounce 600 milliliter of boiling water and cook for five minutes. Please remove the water. Remain eight tablespoons of water and put liquid sauce into the noodles. Stir fry for 30 seconds. Put cheese powder on and stir well and serve. So, um, we're going to go ahead and open this up now. This is another square one. Monkey likes the round ones. <laughs> it's all the same after they get put it, but it's cool. I get it. I like them too. So, let's go ahead and there's our there's our sauce there and this is our cheese sauce it doesn't have any flakes on this in this one so I can't remember if I've tried this one before but I know I did a cheese flavored one or a couple of them and they were really good so far guys I have liked every one of them I just like some of them more than others but really the the hot ones are, are really really good um, but there's the serving suggestion. I got a couple more when I get down to the last one. We're gonna have some fun with it. We're just gonna we're gonna add some stuff to it and, and kind of like make a little a little meal out of it. Monkey had to go. Or well she didn't have to. Monkey went to visit her mom. She goes every day to see her mom. She only missed one day, but um she goes every day to see her mom, spends a couple hours with her in the evening, takes her outside and so she can sit and enjoy the the weather it's been pretty nice past couple it was supposed to rain today i didn't start on the toyota yesterday because it was supposed to rain today and i didn't want the head off of there getting them cylinders rusted so anyway that's what's going on with that uh just got a notification uh 86 degrees feels like 92 partly cloudy so um but yeah it was supposed to rain today it didn't it did rain in wildwood so but yeah so this is what we're gonna make. I'm just waiting on the water to boil. I got it over here. It's getting hot right now, so we're gonna take this over and we'll put them in. We'll put these in the water. We'll cook them for five minutes, and then we'll stir fry them for 30 seconds. So stick around, guys, and I'll, I'll get you set up over here by the stove. Okay, so we're gonna put these in here. Come on, guys. <laughs> Come on out. All right, we're gonna put these in here. Make a mess as always. Um, we're gonna boil these for five minutes. By the way, guys, eight tablespoons is one third a cup. So, you know, you can do it that way, but um uh -oh. <laughs> some noodles on the burner. Okay, that smells great. <laughs> Alright, so did that once monkey walked in. What are you burning? <laughs> Look, noodles. <laughs> All right, let's give this five minutes. Okay, now we're gonna uh, go ahead and stir fry these noodles up. We wanna add this stuff first. That way the noodles won't stick as bad, or they shouldn't stick at all. This is the stuff that really puts the spice in it, guys. Get that in there. 
Okay. Now, got our chopsticks here, which I can't use because of my arm. But the funny thing is, when we went and had that, uh, went to that restaurant the other day, uh, last week or whatever, whatever day it was, um, I was using them just fine. So they say do this about 30 seconds. So that's probably 30. So I'm going to go ahead and cut the heat off and I'm going to put this in a bowl and we'll take it over there on the counter and we'll go ahead and put our uh, cheese sauce in. We'll give that a try. Okay. Now we got our cheese sauce pack here. It's not really a sauce, it's more of a powder, but it'll make a creamy sauce once you mix it up. So, again, like I said, I like to do things the way they suggest because that way, if somebody says, well, and if I don't like it or something, somebody can't say, well, you know, it's because you didn't add enough of this or you added too much of that or and they would be right so that's why I like to do these these reviews the way the way they suggest them it's like you know I'm not gonna go buy a $50 skillet and try to run over it with the car just because they say it can withstand it they're not suggesting you do that that's why they say don't try this at home it's just giving you an idea yeah it's a strong skillet it's a strong pan whatever you know so I try to review stuff like that in everyday you know situations and um, like that I'm going to be using it in or or whatnot uh, you know like I'm not going to freeze a flashlight in a block of water in, in, in water and make it freeze in, into a block of ice I'm not going to do that drop it on concrete a hundred times because it says it can withstand it well, anything you drop on concrete a hundred times is going to eventually break. If you have a flashlight that you've dropped a hundred times, you shouldn't. Maybe you shouldn't be walking in the dark, right? Okay, let's get you up here and let's give this a shot. Okay. Yeah, when we went to the Vietnamese restaurant, I I used them really good, and we had noodles. It's called um, Noodle World very good very good food what we had um, so let me just get my regular fork here which I still have trouble with trying to trying to spin it but that's yeah, okay all part of life take the good with the bad and all that stuff right just enjoy yourself and every day that the gophers aren't bringing your mail is a good day right okay so nice and hot smells delicious but they they all do all these um bull dacks are are good they're all very very good you know um like i said i've liked every one of them just some of them i like a little more than the others but i wouldn't turn down any of them they're very very good so let's give us a shot mm. man you can really taste that cheese now this one is a little warm. Not, when I say little, I mean a lot. So, <laughs> excuse me. I get the hiccups, excuse me, when I eat spicy or hot food. So, it's got an excellent flavor. I'll be back with you until I, let me get rid of my hiccups so I can talk to, to you. <laughs> Okay, I'm back. I just, uh, I, I had to eat a few more bites. It's very, very good. Uh, two thumbs up. Four and a half stars on this one for the heat and the cheese flavor. It's very good. If you like heat, you really like this. If you don't like heat, you're not going to like it. But now, mind you, that red pack. If you don't like the heat, you don't have to put that red pack in there. That's what gives it the spiciness. Uh, I'll show you here. Okay. 
this is what makes it really warm or hot or whatever you can just put you can just put um, the cheese mix in there if you want then you'll just have cheese I may try that I don't know if I got any more of these this kind but yeah that uh, yeah two thumbs up four and a half star but this is what it is again guys so um, yeah if, if you don't like the heat just leave the heat packet out of it and, and I think it would be just fine so alright guys I'm gonna finish my meal here and uh, I'm gonna trim up my beard and stuff for services tomorrow so anyway thanks again guys for watching I appreciate it and um, we'll see you in the next one Shea Bear the Myth the Man of Legend I'm gone for now see you guys soon bye bye and take care